Hi everyone, Alder Yarrow, class of 96, mixed company, 1992-93 base. I've got two memories to share when it comes to mixed company. The first, and the source of probably more all-nighters than I ever pulled for anything else at Stanford, was working with Aaron Hallmark in some dank corner of the Terman Engineering building uh, using the one machine that had uh, the latest version of Photoshop on it to create the album art for uh, the Dogs and Cats Living Together CD. We had no idea what we were doing, but they had some really cool psychedelic plugins for Photoshop. So we had a great time uh, trying to figure out what shade of paisley to make the, uh, the dog and cat kibble for the back cover. But perhaps my favorite memory of Mixed Company was my sophomore year, my second year of Mixed Company, uh, uh, when late at night I heard some pounding at my door uh, and I finally got rolled out. Uh, you see, I didn't actually get into Mixed Company at least not the proper way. Uh, I was a, I don't know, a second string choice. Uh, they, uh, they chose someone else instead of me and they were all ready to go off onto the retreat uh, when somebody mentioned something about a blood oath and uh, whoever they had chosen as a base spooked and decided uh, he didn't want to be in the, the, the group. And so uh, 10 minutes before everyone was leaving for the retreat, Gina Aliota ran over to my room, she lived down the hall, and asked if I wanted to be in mixed company. Uh, I didn't quite exactly know what to say, but I did know that I couldn't go on the retreat. So I, I sort of picked up with the group when they came back and tried to learn things. Uh, and of course, you know, the rest is history, but thanks to uh, the, my thoughtful uh, members uh, my sophomore year, uh, somebody came up with the idea that I finally needed to be rolled out. So just on a random night in the middle of the week, uh, presumably with a forewarning to my roommate, uh, I got the, uh, the pounding on the door and the Star Spangled Banner. Uh, and uh, it was one of the more touching moments of my Stanford undergrad. Love you folks.